Hey, how's it going guys? Uh, apologies if I sound sick. I haven't made a video in a while, so I thought it'd be a good idea to do so now. This video will be slightly different from my usual guides and such. I will be showing you some of my uh, recent favorite uh, budget finds. All of these will be on my spreadsheet, which will be in my link tree or in the description. Uh, remember to subscribe, remember to join the Discord. The free giveaway that winners have been rolled. Their items are currently on the way to warehouse. On screen, you should see the co correspondence between me and the winners, as well as the items being on seller sent. Um, other than that, I'd like to thank everyone for using my link to sign up on PandaBuy. Really appreciate it. It really helps me out a lot. If you haven't already, do sign up uh, on PandaBuy with my link. It really does help the channel. And yeah, I'm just going to get straight into it. First up, we've got um, this very, maybe not very budget, but it's a relatively low budget um, batch for Jordan 1s. You've got some lows, mainly the Travis Scott ones. Uh, but you've also got various other pairs such as the University Blues and the Mo Mochas. Now, I'm just going to start off by saying these are budget batches for all of the items that I'm going to provide. So don't expect the highest quality um, possible because obviously you get what you pay for. But for 250 won, you obviously can't really complain with the way these shoes turn out. As you can see, the suede looks like it's moving. I would say this could pass off quite easily on, on foot especially because after you wear your Mochas for a little bit, even retail ones, the suede is going to die down a little bit. Um, you can see the shape and the overall structure of the shoe. It looks pretty much perfect. Um, you've got various, various choices here. So this is why this is taking the number one spot on the list for today. I forgot to mention that I made a TikTok account. I won't be posting anything very informative or, you know, interesting on here. It's just going to be like dumb stuff. Very, very meaningless stuff. But if you want to follow and, I don't know, leave a like, maybe you'll find something you like here. I'll be posting finds here as well. I would appreciate anything. It's the same as my YouTube, uh, J Drips. I appreciate it. So I'm just going to get on with the video now. Next up, we've got these cool uh, parachute pants. I don't think there's a specific brand that these are a replica of. I think these are just like general items. But for the price, which is 125 you want or around $17, I think. Um, you honestly can't really complain much about these. They look quite cool. And I feel like to a rave or something like that, they would really look nice, especially with like a nice top. You know, some chunky shoes maybe. I think this could be a pretty good uh, outfit idea. Up next, we've got the beanies that are covered in the 15 kilogram unboxing. Um, these are actually insane quality, especially given the price. Like these are dirt cheap. And it does say least purchase quant um, quantity too. You can actually get around this by clicking change here. Okay, wait, let me just, yeah. You click change here and then you would do 7.25, which is half. And then just put other reason. And then you add two and then add them to cut. Now you only receive one, but you've got two quantity. And that's how you get around it. Up next, we've got these um, extremely cheap Tommy Hilfiger swimming shorts. For summer, these are perfect. The quality is actually not bad at all. You see there's two QCs. These are low-key finds. Um, I wanted to show you guys some items that not many people are aware of. Because, you know, some things are very overhyped. You see the tag even looks good. At the end of the day, no one's really going to be calling out Tommy Hilfiger in, in real life. And we've also got uh, Emporio <laughs> Armani for these swimming shorts. Also, a lot of colorways. Only one QC for it for this. And I think, uh, let me just check real quick. We've got another one. We've got the CK ones as well. On my spreadsheet, I've also got a couple more brands of these like 25 U ones uh, swimming shorts. So you should definitely check it out. Okay, up next, we've got these Cortez cargos, cargo joggers, cargos, I guess, not cargo joggers. Um, this is a UK brand, very popular. People really like these. Um, this, this just overall UK drip, I guess you would call it. You've got five different colorways, including the 99P one. Now, these aren't perfect, obviously, but given the, the amount you're paying, which is half of what you would pay on from Go, I believe, uh, you honestly can't really complain. And at the end of the day, I don't think many people will be calling out Cortez in real life. I think the brand is still relatively low key to the point where people don't really expect there to be fakes. So, yeah, that's why I wanted to put this on the list. Next up, we've got these um, soccer or football tracksuits. These are actually crazy, in my opinion. You've got so many different teams and colorways. It's actually nuts. Um, you've got Tottenham Hotspur, obviously. You've got your PSG, whatever. Very cool. You've got QCs here. The best part about this is that you're paying 72 yuan, but you're getting, you're not just getting the top or just the bottom, you're getting both. So yeah, as you can see, this guy received both the top and the bottom for only 72 or, was it 72? Yeah, 72 yuan. Extremely cheap. You can't go wrong with that budget. I think um, given that price, you, you could be happy with basically any quality. Up next, we've got these extremely cheap Air Max 97s. Now, these aren't as low-key. There are quite many sales and quite many, um, quite a lot of QC photos. I mean, given the price, you can't really complain about the quality you receive. These do look like 97s, the silhouette in general. As you wear them out, they're going to look more worn and they're going to adjust to your feet. They're going to wear out a little bit. So um, little quality differences aren't going to be that noticeable. As you can see, like a lot of various colorways and styles, all for 125 you want. I think that's absolutely insane. But yeah, that's, that's, the, that's the next place. 
Up next, we've got these very cheap Eric Emanuel shorts. Now, on this listing specifically, we've only got two different colorways. If you check my spreadsheet, I believe I have four or five different ones within this budget. And they have a couple colorways on each. There's some Gucci ones as well, like Gucci EE. So you might want to check it out. I think for the price, you can't go wrong. The mesh will be relatively see-through when you're wearing them. So do <laughs> make sure you're wearing some nice underwear under that or whatever. You don't want people seeing your, your meat cleaver. But yeah, that's that. Up next, we've got this very, very popular uh, batch for dunks. And these dunks are pretty much like rep 101, really. You don't... Like, any person that starts with reps should start off by getting a pair of these dunks because it's just such a good like paving stone it's a it's a nice way to get into the world of reps and understand how the whole process works with a good variety at a low low price of only 169.91 for a pair of shoes that honestly could pass off as real i'm not even gonna lie to you guys like these uh these pattern dunks i'm sure in some pairs you're gonna get better quality control than the average uh retail nike pair because nike qc as we all know is, is horrendous up next we've got these extremely extremely cheap tns that i'm trying to revolutionize right here as you can see only eight qc photos i showed it in my last video but it hasn't had enough time to ship yet i don't think i think these are absolutely crazy and given the price 105 you on and how many colorways you have how many options you have it's absolutely insane like even if the quality in hand isn't perfect you're paying 105 you on which is like how much you pay for a shirt basically and uh, as you can see from the qc photos they don't look horrendous at all i don't think i'm not an expert in tns in no, by no means I've, I've seen a couple pairs in real life but like the fact that it's even a shoe for that price is insane and the, the variety you get as well is crazy. But this is one of the things that I wanted to put on board specifically because of how cool all of a find it is. Finally, this is a nice summer find. We've got some gallery depth trucker hats. These are perfect for summer, I would say, because you've got the mesh on the back, meaning your, your head won't swear. You won't get, you know, greasy ass hair. You've got so much nice variety, so many different colorways. Adjustable, obviously. I think these hats could really piece a fit together. And given the price, which is quite low, if you really consider um, the quality that you're getting and also the brand that you're getting, because gallery depth is expensive. Um, I think these are like a must cop, especially for summer but yeah that pretty much ties in the whole list together i know this video is a little lazy and i just i just wanted to put something out there for you guys i wanted to um showcase some cool finds that i have on my spreadsheet uh, obviously the spreadsheet will be in the description as i already mentioned so if you want to check any of these links um do go there also if you're new to panda buy and you're watching this just out of curiosity i have made a guide on how to purchase from panda guide how the whole process works I work for Panda Buy as a helper on their Discord server, so I basically know the ins and outs. If you guys have any questions or anything, just comment down below. I'll be more than happy to answer. Once again, I apologize for my voice and if I sound sick and that this video is slightly lazy. I'm just trying to put my spreadsheet on board. I appreciate everyone for watching. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.